السلام عليكم and welcome my friends to become engineer academy channel and I am Anwar. We have learned to arrange items vertically by using a column as we say in the previous video. To know why things look weird on screen as we see here we need to learn about two different properties of column. These two different properties are main axis alignment and cross axis alignment. In this video we will talk about cross axis alignment. That means how the children looks like vertically or how children should be placed vertically so here i will give the column across sorry i have delete parentheses cross axis alignment the cross axis alignment class dot stretch so if you just add the dot you will sh uh, a lot of values i think six shows but here we need to use stretch for stretch if i ha hot reload now as you say uh, the width is 100 Poor sense. Although that inside inside the box here, we've specified a width property of one hundred. When using cross axis alignment dot stretch, the box will take all the width of the screen, and the width property will no longer takes effect. As a result, we don't need to use this property, so let's remove it. Let's hot reload. And as you see, as you see, we will get the same result. I will talk a little about the code formatting with Dart if if empty so in other language we don't use comma at the last element as you see here the last element we we don't need to use comma here also it is the last the first and the last we don't need to use comma so but in darts we do that So here in code, I reformat file, whole file run. As you see, if there is some problem, it will be reformatted, or we can click. Uh, where is it? Here, reformat with Dart. If empty for example I will here d remove one comma code reformat with also here code reformat with dart as you see here if there is no comma it will be uh, boxed so we will add our comma and make our code more readable here virgil so sorry comma not virgil virgil in french i will stop this video here and in the next video we will add some other boxes see you